Hey everybody, this is Noah again. I was getting a lot of questions about the Pin TV virtual scoreboard software. So I figured I'd put together a quick video and show you guys how easy it was to set it up. So the first thing you're going to see when you log into the virtual scoreboard software is you're going to get a list of questions. Like what sport are we playing today? Now when I select my first sport, I'm going to get like a list of questions to kind of narrow down um, the details and the rules of that sport. And then we, we launch it. We could probably do this in about 10 or 15 seconds. So let's go ahead and get started. Uh, wrestling. Well, let's just do wrestling. We do a lot of wrestling. Uh, which style of wrestling do we do? Do we do folk style, freestyle, Greco? We're going to do folk style today. Are we doing high school or college? Let's do college. And are we running an individual or team event today? Let's run a team one. How long are the periods? 3-2-2. Two, two. That's correct for college. And then does all of this look right? And I click yes. So once I click yes, I'm going to come up with the uh, user interface and also the uh, virtual scoreboard, you, which you will then drag and drop over to. So this is a virtual scoreboard right here. So what you do is you drag and dra drag this over to the Pin TV um, system, and then you make it full screen, and then it's up and running. This is what it starts as right here with no team names in there. But obviously, we got T1, T2 over here where you can start typing names. So let's go ahead and do that. You can do abbreviations up to four letters. So let's just do um, Penn, Penn State. Uh, versus uh, Iowa, or how about Minnesota? Penn State versus Minnesota. That sounds good. And we'll take a look and see what that looks like. Yeah, Penn State versus Minnesota, it all looks good. All right, so let's go ahead and choose the weight class. We're gonna choose 125 pounds, and 125 pounds shows up, that's perfect. And let's go ahead and start the match. So let's say uh, Penn State starts out with an early takedown on Minnesota. Um, they get us some near fall. Minnesota gets an escape. And then let's see what the scoreboard's looking like. Boom. As you can see, Penn State was on top. Let's give Penn State, Penn State another takedown. So riding time, as you see, is going up. Let's make it a bit nice and big here. There we go. Let's make it big for you. So Penn, so riding time is located right under the uh, the match time. And this is this is what the scoreboard looks like. The dots stand for periods. Let's go back to it. So here, let's go back here. Uh, let's go ahead and end this period to show you what happens. Um, show you what happens when a period ends. All right, so the period gets close to the end. Boom, period one has ended. If, uh, if a headlock was going on or a cradle was going on, you can still award points in between periods. Let's say uh, Minnesota got a last second reversal, and you could add those points even in between periods. We have that. So now Minnesota gets a choice in the second period. They choose to defer, and uh, Penn will choose bottom, of course. And then uh, they start the match, start the period. So let's say uh, Minnesota comes out amazing, and they go near fall, near fall, near fall. You'll notice down here we have a match recap, which shows in timestamps all the points that were, that were uh, scored. If we take a look at the scoreboard, you'll see 7 to 12, nice and big. Um, one cool thing, so let's go ahead and end this match. Let's go, uh, let's say Minnesota gets, gets, gets a pin. So we'll come over here, go win by. Minnesota's going to win by a pinfall. And you'll see next match comes up, boom. Did Green win by a pinfall? Yes, they did. And you'll see everything resets, and the team points also um, are appropriate, right? We got four, or we got zero and six, and then the match points. You can always add or subtract points using the plus minus. Uh, one cool thing we have is a dual summary. So if we look over here, we can see, obviously, we can go back and take a look at the entire duel with just one click. Uh, Minnesota wins by pinfall. That was the final score, match score. There's the team score. So that is uh, pretty much everything you need to know about uh, the wrestling virtual scoreboard software.